Welcome to the Figure Zone. Really quickly, this is not a promotional video. I did not get paid by the companies creating or selling these figures. Sideshow Collectibles has some low stock remaining on a bunch of figures. Definitely check into these before they're gone from Sideshow forever. And if you'd like to help out the channel, do me a huge favor. Click on any of the links below in the description that say Sideshow on them. Any purchase you make through Sideshow, whether it's just a purchase, buy it now, or a pre-order, they send me some referral rewards points just for sending you guys their way. So you get your figure, you get your rewards, and they throw me some bonus rewards for sending you guys to them. Thank you so much for everyone who's used that link so far. And speaking of links, I also have two links down below that can save you guys some cash and two of my favorite sellers. Shipping now. Action Force, Valiverse, Delta Trooper, plus also their weapons pack, Charlie. These are great for your Valiverse figures or your G.I. Joe classifieds. Storm Collectibles, King of Fighters, 98, Orochi. Storm Collectibles, Tekken 7, Paul Phoenix. Sentinel, Marvel Fighting Armor, Black Panther. Sentinel, Marvel Fighting Armor, Thor. Vexed Hobby Cell Diorama. These are great because you can buy multiples and make a giant diorama. Plus, there's a freaking light up top. That is sweet. Four Horsemen, Mythic Legion's Half Giant Deluxe Figure. And also, Four Horsemen's Mythic Legion's Ogre Scale Accessories Pack. Damn Toys, Pocket Elite Obsidian Man. Kyolo, Marvel, Amazing, Yamaguchi, Revel Tech, number 25, Deadpool, version 2 reissue. Mezco, 112, Collective, Bishop. Medicom, Mafex number 134, Spider-Man, Into the Spider-Verse, Spider-Gwen, and Spider-Ham Pack. Medicom, Mafex number 174, Justice League, Snyder Cut, Black Suit, Superman. Medicom, Mafex number 148, Wonder Woman, Golden Armor. Awesome figure, horrible movie. True Force, Mega Man X, Designer Series Mega Man. We have three figures from Bandai Spirits with their SH Figure Arts line. We have the Let There Be Carnage Venom, also the Kamen Rider Black Sun, and Spy X Family, Lloyd Forger. Two figures from TB League Executive Replicas series. We have Purgatory and Vampirella. These both look amazing. They look like the shrunken down 1 6 scale versions that I have of these figures. They look awesome. Now I believe these are reissues or just more stock companies are getting in. Prepare your wallets. A butt ton of pre-orders are coming. Jack's Pacific, 
Apex Legends Series 7, Watson, Mirage, and Pathfinder, February 2023, and 74 for the set. There's also a Pathfinder War Machine version for 23 bucks, but the photo looks exactly like the regular version. Okay. Medicos, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, Bruno, Bucciarati, black version, February of 2024, and he is 80 bucks. And he comes with two swappable faceplates, some hands, a zipper, okay. And also, which is a pretty cool accessory here, is a Mario Zuchiro head. I know nothing about this series, but that looks pretty cool. The 90s, TH-015 Shaolin Soccer Movie Monk with Diorama. May of 2023, no price for this just yet. Now with the set, you get the figure, the outfit, some hands. You got magnetic shoes and a magnetic soccer ball, so you can look like he's actually kicking the ball and it's on his foot. That's pretty cool. You got like a faux grass stand, and the wall is reversible, and it's got some magnets in there also, so that's pretty sweet. Bane here. If you're enjoying the video, hit the thumbs up button and helps out the channel big time. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any Bane voiceovers. I mean, 112 scale awesomeness. Memory Toys. Steel Black Bear. March of 2023 release, and he's 110 bucks. This figure is awesome. He's 9 inches tall. He's got 4 hands. Four claw effects. Two have like blood on them, and two have like swooshing wind looking effects going on there. They look pretty awesome. Now, I think he does have a Marvel Legends scale going on if you want. Use him as Marvel Comics Ursa Major, the Russian super soldier bear. How cool would that be? I don't think Marvel Legends ever made a Ursa Major figure yet, but. Yeah, scoop him up for that reason alone. He does look pretty cool. He's got multiple points of articulation. Again, you got the extra hands of blood effects. You can make him fight your Marvel Legends figures or uh, join up a team. So, very cool. Look into this. They've got a couple other figures in this line too that'll fit right in perfectly with your Marvel Legends collection or pretty much any 112 scale collection. This guy is freaking huge. And he looks great. Aosan Workshop Motorcycle. Quarter 2 of 2023. No price is available just yet. This guy's like available in like markets overseas in like Thailand and stuff in Malaysia. So not quite sure of the price just yet. This was meant to go with the 90s toys figure. D. So this looks pretty awesome. You can pretty much get this motorcycle for any of your 112 scale figures. It looks like a pretty decent replica of the Suzuki Ninja. Let me know in the comments below. Mezco 112 Collective Owlman October 2023 and he is a hundred bucks. Now the figure is from a movie called Lord of Tears. I've never seen it, but I think I want to check it out now. Now he's got over 27 points of articulation. You've got four hands, you got a cloth outfit, so that's pretty cool. Lots of accessories, and one of them is an altar with a freaking head that looks awesome. Some sweet blood effects, and a stand. We have two figures from the Medicom Mafex line for the Marvel MCU Captain America Winter Soldier movie. Both are quarter one of 2024 and $105 each. Number 203 is the Winter Soldier. He's got three heads, extra hands, knives, you got the shield, and a stern. And also number 202 is Captain America in the stealth suit. He comes with three heads also, a helmet, some extra hands, he's got his regular Captain America shield, plus he's got the sweet stealth shield, and also a stern. 
Both of these figures look pretty cool. The Steve head, yeah, it looks pretty cool. It's like a little light, but I like the cap heads. But these are the big step up from the Marvel Legends figures. A little pricey, but worth it. Kotobukiya, Buso Shinki X Megami Device Strarf Model Kit, June of 2023, and she is 110 bucks. Now she has three swab blah 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 face plates, lots of accessories. You also get the cool stand, which is just like a basic little flight stand. It seems to work. And what's cool about the Kotobukiya figures, a lot of these model kit figures here, the armor pieces can be swapped with a lot of the other figures in the line and their other lines. So they're all made almost like in the same scale with the same ports to swap in the armor pieces. So that's cool. Kotobukiya, Alice Gear, Aegis, Megami Device, Motsumi, Kawashi Model Kit. August of 2023, and she is 90 bucks. What's pretty cool too is she also comes with a present code for in-game use. That's pretty awesome. Now she's got the three swappable faces with some swappable armor. Also a bunch of accessories. And like I said before, these armor pieces can be swapped out with most of the other Kotobukiya figures. I love these model kits because you can just leave them standard or throw on as much armor as you want or swap out the armor with some other figures and combine all the armors to make some craziness. We have a stack of Bandai Spirits SH Figure Arts figures up next. First is Kamen Rider Kuga Shinkochu Seihu, the Rising Dragon Form, July of 2023 and 135 bucks. Then we have the Kamen Rider Tycoon Ninja Form, July of 2023 and 135 bucks and what's cool is the parts can be swapped with the common writers gets to make entry raise form and the common writers claws sasori july of 2023 and this is 140 bucks and this can be taken apart and combined with the common writers birth sehu so again take all the pieces apart make some crazy looking armor and also make some cool freaking weapons that is awesome continuing the bundai spirits sh figure arts line we have ultramon decker terraphaser june of 2023 and 160 bucks and the figure has a swappable face, a swappable arm, and a sweet looking sword. And the figure itself looks really cool. Dragon Ball Superhero Beast Gohan, August of 2023, and he is 110 bucks. Now he's got three swappable faces, some extra hands, and a cool beam effect here that I believe comes with like a little pedestal stand they're calling it for him and the beam so the beam looks like it's flying through the air. That is awesome. Dragon Ball Z, third form, Frieza. September of 2023 and he is 135 books. He has a swappable head some face plates, also some extra hands and some extra arm parts and a pink effect. And the last figure in the Bandai Spirits SH Figure Arts line we have from Chainsaw Man. We have Samurai Sword, September of 2023 and he is 75 bucks. And he's got a swappable lower jaw. He's also got two pairs of hands and he looks fracking awesome Kyodo Reveltech NR006 Pirates of the Caribbean Jack Sparrow July of 2023 and he is 110 bucks now he's got 16 points of articulation 
leather and cloth materials for the outfit. He's got some extra hands, a hat, sword, gun, and he's got a sweet pirate ship base with the flag on it. Good Smile Company, Figma, number 594. Bunny Suit Planning, Sophia F. Shearing, Bikini Armor Version, February of 2024, and she's 125 bucks. And she's got the swappable armor pieces along with four faceplates, extra hands, weapons, and a stern. This figure looks awesome. I thought Milk Tea Girl was cool, but this one is a little bit cooler. Digging on this one. Looks very awesome. Executive Replicas, the Rocketeer and Betty Deluxe 2 pack, July of 2023 and 150 bucks. Now, this is based off the comic book series. The Rocketeer has 31 points of articulation, six pairs of hands, helmet, pistol, rocket pack, and a blast off effect. Now, Betty does not come with any accessories, but she has 28 points of articulation. And if there's any Betty Page fans out there, click the card at the top of the screen on the right side there to see my review of the 1-6 scale TB League Betty Page figure with the seamless body. That figure is amazing. One of my favorites. So if you're a fan, you definitely don't want to miss out on that amazing fracking figure. Now, I love the packaging for this set that looks really cool great job executive replicas storm collectibles mortal combat shao khan now there is a standard version and a deluxe version both are quarter three of 2023 release and the standard figure is 100 bucks now it's going to come with two head sculpts five pairs of hands a spear and a hammer. Now, if you want the deluxe, that's going to be 160. That is going to come with three head sculpts, five pairs of hands. You get two spears, plus the hammer and the gigantic fracking throne, which looks amazing. So the figure itself is awesome for 100 bucks, but for an extra 60 bucks, you get another head, another spear, plus this throne. This is so cool. I would definitely scoop this up quick if you're a Mortal Kombat fan before it ends up disappearing then you're just stuck with the basic figure which is awesome but this throne that is well worth the money. Fun. Check out the links in the description below. I've got one from my Facebook group. Join up. A lot of cool people on there. Let's have some cool figure talk. I also have an Amazon affiliate account where they pay me like 2% of each one of your purchases. Okay. And I also have a Teespring account with some cool movie quote series in my 66 Batman henchman shirt, which is pretty sweet. Let me know your thoughts on these figures in the comments below. Also, where do you guys purchase your figures from? I'll try to get you some more cool discount codes, which is always great. And if you want to see some more 112 scale awesomeness, click the video to the left or the playlist to the right. Thanks so much for watching. Till the next video.